Hi, and welcome back to Visme's new features recap. Over the past few weeks, we've been refining existing features to make your workflow more seamless and efficient. Plus, we've just launched something new to help you build a stronger foundation in design. So let's jump right in. Edit with AI just got a major upgrade. You can now use your own content and apply it to a template of your choice. Plus, we've expanded Edit with AI to support two new content types. Previously, it was available for presentations, documents, printables, and social media graphics. Now, you can also use it for web graphics and charts. There are now multiple ways to bring your own content into Edit with AI. In addition to answering template-related questions, you can upload a document, PDF, or doc, paste a link, or manually input text up to 2,000 characters. This update makes content creation faster and more efficient, giving you a strong starting point so you can adjust your design as needed in the BizMe Editor. We're always working to improve our AI tools, so let us know new features that you'd like to see or what we should enhance in our existing ones. Based on user feedback, we've made several updates to grids and guidelines, essential tools for aligning objects and creating well-balanced compositions. So here's what's new. In guidelines, you can now choose your choice of measurement, pixels, inches, or centimeters. When you hover over or drag a guideline, its measurement will appear at the top. Plus, when a guideline is centered on the canvas, both the guide and its label will turn red for better visibility. For grids, we've added more color options so you can pick one that stands out against your design. Grids also now always overlay all design elements, making alignment even easier. We hope these updates make designing in Visme more precise and, of course, efficient. We've also just launched our first design course to help you build a stronger foundation in design and improve your content creation skills. If you've been creating content with templates but still feel like your final designs could be better or tried to start a design from scratch only to feel stuck on making it look amazing, then this course is for you. The Digital Designs Foundation course covers 11 lessons on essential design principles, structure, topography, color, consistency, layouts, and a whole lot more. By the end of the course, you'll have a solid understanding of how to craft better designs. Plus, you'll earn a certificate that you can show off on LinkedIn, your website, or your CV. The best part? It's completely free, and in just a couple hours, you'll gain skills that will improve every design you create from now on. Sign up today, and we'll leave the link down in the description. So, I know it was quick, but that's a wrap on this month's feature recap. We hope these updates make your workflow smoother, and if there's a feature you'd love to see in Visme, let us know down in the comments. Don't forget to subscribe so you stay in the loop with all the latest updates. Until next time, I'll see you later.